Okay, now we're gonna do the yellow thread. Same thing. I'm gonna drop it through here twice. There we go. Under the little tensioner. There's a, another dot here. It wants to catch here. This time you're gonna go over the top. It does separate uh, yellow and green there. It has its own little catcher here, but they do share this last little hook there. Haha. -ha. Now we're gonna go ahead and thread through the needle. Again, we're going to use our favorite tweezer in the whole world. Let's drop this down. And you can actually raise the needle as high as it will go, which isn't that high, but just to give you a little more access when you're threading. So let's grab this guy. Let's go in. Come on, buddy. You can do it. There we go. I'm going to catch it from the other side. There we go. I actually need to use my tool. Okay, now I've got yellow, lift the presser foot, put it under with the rest. Now I've got all four threads coming together. Okay, let's see if it's gonna work. I'm gonna try a chain stitch. Uh-oh. There we go. Come on. <gasps> Look at that! This is what we're after. So now you can see all four colors coming through. Um, and this is really helpful when you're learning because it helps you understand what each one does. If you look at the little pictures here, it shows you that the yellow makes that straight stitch. This makes the middle stitch. This makes the far stitch. Um, and the red is on the edge. Pretty fun. Okay, so that is threading the machine.